Hey adventurers, welcome to 60 Seconds of Fame, where we take one minute to tell you as much as we can about one species that you might see in the wild. This time we're going to talk about the marbled salamander. So let's put 60 seconds on the clock, and away we go. The marbled salamander is named for its, you guessed it, its marbled black and white pattern. Now the scientific name is Ambistoma opacum. Ambistoma meaning to cram into the mouth. Why is it called that? Nobody's really sure, but it's still a really cool name to have. Opacum is Latin for opaque, shaded, darkened, and this refers to the dark color of the salamander. The belly or the venter is all black, but on top they have these silver to gray crossbars. Uh, and the marble salamander is actually sexually dimorphic, which means that the males and the females look a little different. The males have silver, white or silver crossbands, where the females have more gray crossbands. These salamanders can be found throughout the eastern United States. Unlike most other salamanders in Ambistoma, when the females lay their eggs, they do it on land, and they actually stay around to protect uh, their eggs until they hatch. Uh, and another cool thing is North Carolina in 2013, they named the marble salamander their, their state amphibian. And with that sound, that's our time. If you'd like to learn more, go to SchecterGuides.com or search for Schecter Natural History in the App Store. Links in the description. Please remember to like and subscribe and stay tuned for our next episode of 60 Seconds of Fame.